Hello everyone, welcome back. Today, we will take a deep dive into how you can create your own KDP book cover using Canva. This tutorial will guide you step by step, ensuring that even if you are a beginner, you can design a professional quality book cover with ease. Let's get started. Canva is a free online design tool that allows you to create beautiful book covers, even if you don't have any prior design experience. Amazon KDP or Kindle Direct Publishing enables you to self-publish books without any upfront costs. Amazon handles printing and distribution, so all you need to do is upload your manuscript and cover design. To create your KDP book cover, start by opening Google Chrome and searching for KDP book cover template. Click on the first link that appears, which will take you to Amazon's cover calculator page. This tool helps you determine the correct dimensions for your cover based on your book's specifications. First, enter your book details, including trim size, page count, and paper type. For this tutorial, let's say we are creating a paperback book cover with standard color and cream paper. Choose a left to right reading direction and ensure your measurements are in inches for accuracy. Next, select your interior trim size. Suppose we are working with a 5.5 x 8.5 inch book and our book has 150 pages. Once you have filled in this information, click on Calculate Dimensions. The page will generate the exact dimensions for your book cover, including the front, back and spine. The tool will generate a downloadable template that includes the front cover, back cover and spine dimensions. Download the template and open it in a design software such as Canva. Use this template as a guide to ensure your design fits within the required margins. Your downloaded file will be in a zip format. Once the download is complete, locate the file in your computer's downloads folder and extract its contents. Inside the extracted folder, you will find both PNG and PDF versions of your template ready for use. Now, head over to Canva and log into your account. Click on Create a Design at the top right corner of the screen. From the drop down menu, select Custom Size. Before entering the dimensions, change the unit from pixels to inches to ensure accurate sizing. Next, enter the width and height according to the dimensions required by Kindle Direct Publishing (KDP). This ensures that your design meets the necessary specifications for printing and formatting. Once your blank canvas is ready, upload the PNG template you downloaded. Adjust the image so that it fits perfectly within the canvas by scaling or repositioning it as needed. If it doesn't fit correctly, double check the dimensions and make any necessary adjustments. To ensure that you design within the correct areas, reduce the transparency of the template so you can see your work while keeping the guidelines visible. After positioning it properly, lock the template in place to prevent accidental movement. This will help maintain alignment and accuracy throughout the design process, ensuring a professional and polished final result. Let's start designing a modern and minimalist cover using geometric elements. Instead of a photo, we'll create a stylish composition with abstract shapes. Click on Elements and search for abstract shapes. Select a variety of shapes, such as triangles, circles and squares, to add visual interest. Experiment with different arrangements by adjusting their size, rotation and layering to create a unique artistic effect. You can overlap some shapes and reduce their transparency for a subtle, modern touch. Next, customize the background to enhance the overall aesthetic. Click on the color panel and select a soft pastel shade, such as lavender, sky blue or blush pink. Pastel tones create a calming and elegant feel, making the design more visually appealing. If desired, you can also add a subtle gradient or texture for depth. Once you're happy with the arrangement, review the balance and alignment to ensure a polished, professional look. Next, let's work on the spine. To make it stand out, select a contrasting color such as deep navy or charcoal gray. Use the Elements section to find a thin rectangle and place it along the spine. 
You can also add a subtle texture by searching for grunge texture in Canvas Elements and overlaying it with reduced transparency. For the back cover design, instead of using a plain background, incorporate a subtle yet elegant pattern to enhance the overall aesthetic. Click on Elements and search for seamless patterns. Choose a simple, light-toned pattern that complements the design without being overpowering. Once selected, place it in the background and adjust its transparency slightly to ensure it remains soft and sophisticated. The goal is to add texture and visual interest while keeping the design refined and professional. This subtle addition will elevate the back cover, making it more visually appealing without distracting from the primary design elements. Now, let's add the book title. Click on text and select add a heading. Choose a modern bold font like Montserrat or Poppins. For this tutorial, let's name our book The Hidden Path. Adjust the font size and place it in the center of the front cover. To make the text stand out, go to Effects and add a subtle shadow or outline. Below the title, add the author's name in a smaller, lighter font for contrast. To enhance the design, navigate to the Elements tab and search for lines. Select a thin, elegant line that complements the overall aesthetic of your book cover or document. Position it directly below the title to create a clean and visually appealing separator. This subtle touch improves readability and adds a sense of structure. Additionally, consider incorporating a small decorative element such as a minimalist icon or symbol that aligns with your book's theme. For example, if your book is about nature, you might add a delicate leaf or branch. These design choices help create a polished and professional look. Once you are happy with your design, go to the top right corner and click on Share. Select Download and choose the PDF print option to maintain high resolution. After downloading, head over to your KDP dashboard and upload the file. Your book cover is now ready for publishing. If you want to take your design to the next level, consider experimenting with Canva's advanced tools. For example, you can use the Gradients tool to create smooth color transitions. Simply search for Gradient under Elements. Choose one that suits your design and adjust its transparency to blend with your background. Another way to enhance your cover is by adding texture overlays. Search for watercolor or paper texture in Elements and place them over your design with a reduced opacity. This will give your book cover a more professional and unique feel. Additionally, you may want to add a tagline or a short description on the back cover. To do this, go to the text section again, add a subheading and choose a complementary font that is easy to read. Keep the font size smaller than the main title, but still visible. If you are publishing a series, you can create a consistent theme across your book covers by using the same fonts, colors and layout styles. Canva allows you to copy and resize designs, making it easy to maintain uniformity across multiple books. Finally, before you upload your book cover to KDP, preview it on multiple devices to ensure everything looks as expected. Use Canva's preview mode or download a low-resolution version to check for any design flaws. For authors looking to make their book covers stand out, Canva's Pro version offers more customization features such as premium fonts, access to a wider variety of elements, and the ability to resize designs instantly. This can be a great investment if you plan on publishing multiple books. That's it for today's tutorial. If you found this helpful, be sure to like the video and subscribe for more tutorials. See you in the next one.